Before starting this review, I want to thank MMPR for giving me a game review key. Now on to the review. Mind you from experiencing, thrust players into the heart of the land called Tirnabolg, a realm overrun by seven devil kings who not only stolen precious treasures, but have transformed the Dragon King's tower into a menacing dungeon. As another world adventure summoned by the Queen of Fairies, your mission is clear, defeat the devil kings, reclaim the stolen treasures, and restore peace to the land. With the title as lengthy and descriptive as the objectives, Monyu promises a whimsical journey through the dungeons, battles, and character growth. However, beneath the charming exterior lies a game that fails to live up to its potential, offering a dungeon crawling experience that struggles to captivate. The game welcomes players into an endearing, chibi art style, bringing to life a world filled with colorful characters, monsters, and environments. The monster variety is commendable, accompanied by a plethora of chibi portraits for heroes and NPCs. The visual appeal succeeds in capturing attention, but unfortunately, it becomes a fleeting distraction from the game's underlying issues. The core gameplay revolves around first-person dungeon crawling, where players navigate grip-based maps, uncovering treasures and engaging in turn-based battles. Each dungeon floor presents an environmental puzzle, with the ultimate goal of defeating a unique boss. The game's soundtrack, while okay, fails to leave a lasting impression. The potential for its intricate party setup and character growth exists within Monyu. Monster sound effects are standard, and the absence of voice acting diminishes the overall auditory experience. Notably, the game ties the gameplay mechanics to sound, which poses a challenge to players with hearing impairments. When it comes to character growth and customization, the potential for intricate party setup and character growth exists. Players can choose their own character's names, appearance, and class, adding a layer of personalization. However, the game's reliance on equipment levels and RNG-based drop introduces frustration. The fun factor is hampered by the lack of balance, making progression feel more like a stroke of luck rather than a result of strategic planning. Monyu defeats strong monsters, gains strong weapons and armor, you may be defeated, but don't give up, become stronger, I believe there will be a day when the heroes defeat the Double King, offers glimpse of potential greatness, but unfortunately falls short of expectations. The detailed character customization and promising dungeon exploration are marked by uninspiring visuals, repetitive gameplay, and unbalanced difficulty. The game system feels disjointed, with crucial mechanics left unexplained. Despite its lengthy title, the game fails to stand out amongst its dungeon crawling peers. Which leads me to not recommend this game to any of my viewers, so I cannot recommend a game to y'all that will be frustrating rather than fun. Thank you for watching and have a great day.